against the reigning PCW World Tag Team Champions Jeff and Jerry Brown and their partner, the PCW Uncut Champion Chris Richter. And my gosh, look at this that the trendsetters are bringing out. It looks like a like a plywood board, and it's got some fluorescent light tubes taped to it. You know what, Rob? Oh my God! I don't know if you noticed this, but uh, just as the uh, wrestlers were coming out, they brought in an RN, a registered nurse, to kind of look over the wrestlers to make sure that there is no physical, mental, or spiritual bodily harm inflicted on these guys to any such degree that they may need require medical attention. Well, I'm certainly glad to know that there are members of the medical profession here at ringside because with the fact that there are no rules and the fact that all six of these men have such anger towards each other over various issues that there is going to be some serious pain dished out before this one is all said and done. You know what, Rob? You know, here this week tonight, we have, like I said, we have some great athletes. Bodily harm is definitely going to be inflicted, and uh, my money is on Mace being the one to inflict the most pain this early in the match. What do you think? Mace Malone, the one with the SWAT team training, and he knows what it's like to get down and dirty when need be. And the Transcenters, of course, they have some scores to settle with the Brown brothers, most notably, oh, the uh. Jack Holmes, but Chris Richter, you know, he, he thinks he knows judo, but not well. as much as he thinks. He just... He just racked himself up with those nunchucks. Man, those nunchucks, hey, I think those should be in front of a licensed professional, and this guy is not even close to that. Chris Richters clearly doesn't know as much as he says he does, but we shall see if he knows how to get hardcore because that's exactly what's going to be required in this match here tonight. All right, hey, check out Mace Whoa, Malone going off. Oh, check out Mace going off with these nunchucks over here, brother. Same proficiency with the nunchucks that I saw from the great Kabuki more than 20 years ago. He knows how to handle them. Well, you know what? Mace is definitely going to know how to handle the nunchucks as well as his opponent tonight. Let's get this match started, Rob. Yes, let's do. And now we've got some people climbing in the ring, and Malone goes after Richter. The trendsetter is going after the Brown brothers, and Richter with those nunchucks across his back. Mace Malone handling those nunchucks very well, jabbing them into the ample midsection of Chris Richter. All right, yeah, you know, you got Chris Whitaker in the corner over here being as manhandled by the nunchucks, and the trend center of the Brown Boys going at it. Did you see that move right there, Rob? Right Absolutely. on his back. Adam Thornstall going right after Jerry Brown. Meanwhile, we have Jeff Brown and what is Jack for? Dalton outside the ring, and what? Snapmare and a kick to the back by Adam Thornstow. On top with Here the cover, one, two, that and oh, almost a three count. Now we have all, that oh, one was back. What a dive by Malone with the nunchucks right into the groin region of Chris Richter, and now a chair being thrown. It's going to be a madhouse here before it's all over. Oh, low-level drop kick right to the side of Malone's knee. Now, see, now we're talking about no rules, no holds barred. Anything goes, Rob. I don't know, man. I mean, that... That may not be the way to go tonight, man. I mean, we want to see these guys wrestle early, later on in the career. Chris Richter taking Mace Malone down with an elbow and trying to show off a few moves there. Man, they're using chairs, they're using nunchucks, they're using everything they can, and there goes Mace right outside the ring. And meanwhile, Jeff Brown going after the hype Adam Thornstow, or rather, that's Jack, Jack Dalton, mainstream Jack Dalton, DDT, but now Richter attacking Dalton. Well, you know, you got one of the Brown boys on his back right now, kind of helpless, but Ritker is, Ritker is in the ring right over here, Chris Ritker. And uh, you know what? He does not seem like that much of a threat at this moment, but, hey, the tables could turn. Jack Dalton taken off of that top turnbuckle, and Chris Richter is now outside the ring going after, I believe that's Mason Malone on the floor on the front side of the ring. And we have Jerry Brown now with Jack Dalton, and they're fighting right over the ring steps and right over that board with the fluorescent tubes on it. They'd better be careful if they don't want to get glass all in them. That's oh, it. my God! That's it, baby. That's Sweet it. God almighty! Here comes the EMT to see about Jack Dalton. Oh, they're, they're, they're tearing up the EMT. Now, what is this? Brown Brothers beating up the EMT now on the ramp. Chris Richter is back in the ring. Jack Dalton lying in a pile of broken glass. Now, wait a second. Now, what is that going to do to help to beat up the RN? He's just trying to admit it's some first aid. The Brown Brothers are some bad apples. Oh, oh. God, right across the back. Man, I cannot believe that. This match cannot possibly go very much longer if this continues. My God, did you see that? I, mean, I he, sure did. That he, sucker exploded. Right over his back. Oh, man, hey, Rob, get in there and find out if he's okay. Look at him. Adam Thornstow outside the ring. Meanwhile, inside the ring, we've got Mace Malone firing away at Chris Richter in the corner, but the Brown brothers are in, and it's basically a three-on-one right now. Man, these Brown brothers came in here determined to inflict pain and take somebody out. 
Double atomic drop, and now the Brown brothers with a... Oh, that's double, it, Rob. Double goozle type maneuver on Mason Malone, and that's got to be it. Chris Richter coming in, dropping the leg. Oh, come on. And this uh, has got to be all she wrote. Chris Richter on top with a pin, and oh, oh, only a two count. Almost a three, Rob. Hey, Mace, I'm glad you hung in there. Keep up the good work. Try and get to your feet as soon as you can, buddy. Adam Thornstow snap mared in there by Jeff Brown. Jerry Brown going after Malone, and now here comes Jeff Brown off the top rope. One time oh. onto Thornstow. Man, I think Thornstow is still trying to recover from having that bulb crash on his back. And once again, it's it's a three on two right now. Look at Chris Ritker over here working on Mace Malone. Mainstream Jack Dalton still on the floor in a pile of broken glass from those light tubes. Jerry Brown firing away at Thornstow inside the ring. All right, we have we have one of the trend centers is down. The R rate is down. Mace Malone, Lord knows where he's at. Here he is outside the ring being worked on by Chris Ritker, the uncut champion. And Mace Malone, of course, wants a shot at that uncut belt, but every chance he get, every time he gets an opportunity, he gets screwed, but there are uh, it looks like the baton of Mace Malone's right to the head of Adam Thornstone. Okay. Malone coming back on Richter on the floor now. Oh, my God.